What's going on, guys? So I just recently got in the mail. I'm finally getting around to it. It's been a few days since it came in. I uh, wanted to wait till I had an opportunity to record this to do a first impressions with you guys. But we have the new San Diego from City Rhythm Fragrances. Now, I have looked over the note breakdown. It looks to be quite fresh with a little touch of floral. It looks like something that's really up my alley for the warmer weather. So we're going to bust this open, check it out, and see if it's the best of the house, if it can dethrone Miami Tropical Seduction, which is my favorite from the house, or does it fall somewhere else in line with the other fragrances from the house? So stay tuned. Wax seal still on the side. Magnetic flip top. Nice touch. This is the newest presentation from City Rhythm. It has a card with the fragrance info. This is the non-shimmer bottle. Because you can get it with or without the shimmer. I chose to not get the shimmer. Pacific Sun. So breaks down the story. And then on the other side is the note card. Okay. So this is my first time checking out these new bottles, and they have they have a metal plaque on them now. So we'll finish peeling that off. It's a sharp looking bottle. I like the base of it. The base is very very cool looking, in my opinion. Of course. Come on, there we go. There's the focus. I love the base of this. Oh, well, I peel off the top as well. Niles has definitely stepped up his presentation exponentially. This looks really, really good. Nice and smooth. Okay, let's give it a spray. Two good sprays. Smells like violet leaf right off the top. Some type of orangey smell. And a big hit of gin, so there's probably juniper berries. Let's take a look. I have notes on the screen. Top notes, juniper berries, blood orange, heliotrope, sea salt, lavender. Okay, most of that makes sense. In the heart, nutmeg, coriander seed, almond, Moroccan jasmine, violet leaves. There you go. Iris. Okay. In the base, beechwood, mm, sea breeze, ambergris, and vanilla. Okay. Definitely get a little bit of that salt and... Big old sheen on my hand. Niles does 50% oil concentration. So, yeah. Ooh, this is... This has definitely got an aquatic feel to it. And I don't have any iris really jumping out at me. There's a light, fresh floral tone to it. I don't get a whole bunch of spice... There's a little sharpness to this orange, but I'm getting the sea salt. I'm getting some aromatic lavender that's not really making it too soapy, but there's a little touch of it. And I get the violet leaf for sure. And it does have kind of a salty sea breeze type of... It's funny that one of the notes is listed as sea breeze. I know it's an accord. It's creating a sea breeze accord. But mixed with the sea salt, it makes for a nice aquatic... Kind of marine, more of a marine feel to the fragrance. This might be better than Miami Tropical Seduction. Yet to be determined, it's kind of a neck and neck type of thing here. I do like it better than Manhattan. I like it better than Rhythm and Pulse. Frequent Flyer is more of a, you know, a, a layering fragrance than anything else. But that orange is zesty. City Rhythm, San Diego, Pacific Sunset. Definitely smells good, I have to say. Love the bottle. Absolutely loving the bottle here. It's got a little touch of powder, and maybe that's some spice that's adding to the zest of this orange, because it does have a little bit of a warmth to it. 
but nothing that's really coming across as nutmeg to me anyway. This is lovely. Ambergris, vanilla, almond. I don't really get any almond. But it is the top of the fragrance. It's a heavy, heavy oil concentration. So the top note's going to stick around longer than, you know, an EDT or an EDP will. Because it's still all about this zesty blood orange. The violet leaf and sea salt airiness peeking out. That's probably the Heli... I forgot this heliotrope in the top. Yeah, that might be the floral tone that I'm getting. Because I don't get a distinctive iris smell. It may come in later. I mean, seeing iris obviously excites me when I see that in a fragrance. But it's not really jumping out too heavy. This is much more... This is definitely a, a summer weather type of, type of fragrance. Pacific Sunset is the theme for San Diego. And I can kind of get the idea here of the sun setting by the beach in San Diego. I can kind of see, I can kind of see that. I mean, I've never been to San Diego, but I don't know. It's, it's got more of a, more of a beachy feel than I think it's even getting credit for. Let's read the story, shall we? The city of San Diego once visited quietly, undeniably, and indelibly gets under the skin. This remarkable city's essence is reflected in its instinctive ability to maintain a most delicate equilibrium between modern metropolis and a home to a wealth of natural wonders. Blue skies filled with the hazy paint strokes of drifting clouds, salty wafts of sea air that infiltrate the senses, and a thrilling view of the Pacific sunset drenching the Vista the vista and vibrant bursts of color. These ethereal elements win their way around towering skyscrapers and meander down bustling streets to create a contradictory and magnetic draw irresistible to any who experience it. San Diego Pacific Sunset is City Rhythm's exploration of these sensations through scent, paying tribute to the region's bountiful groves, the sweet juices of a ripe blood orange mingle with the invigorating juniper berries and sea salt to stir your senses as San Diego blossoms on the skin. This bright opening soon accorded a deeper potency as scents of almond, nutmeg, and jasmine are carried forward on a heady aquatic breezes, bringing your senses to San Diego's white sand seashores. The ground base notes of beech wood and ambergris envelop a heart of warm vanilla while that ever-present sea breeze continues to round out the journey to this coastal city. With City Rhythm's signature extrate level of parfum concentration, you can be assured that this scent will carry you through a wind-blown day on a ferry to an evening at your favorite seaside cafe. Well-written story, I have to say. Kudos, Niles. This is very breezy, but still has a lot of body to it. It's a very airy scent, which is... Not easy to do with such a high, and I mean such a high oil concentration. I mean, this is still super sheen shine right here going on on my hand, you know. It's very light and airy, and that blood orange is not going anywhere. This opening is staying put for quite a while. I'm digging this, and look, I haven't sprayed my scent of the day yet, just in case I really like this. I was planning on wearing Rome, uh, Rochus Loam. I think I'm going to roll with this. Yeah. Why the hell not? Two good sprays. Five sprays ought to do it with this very strong and airy fragrance. So we're about to head out in a little bit. I wanted to shoot this video beforehand. And uh, I was hoping I was really going to dig this one. This is, even though it says Pacific Sunset, this is much more of a daytime scent. Whereas Miami Tropical Seduction is more of a summer evening, you know, dining by the beach type of feel to the fragrance. So I don't know which one's better as far as which one's my favorite because it's personal preference. This is going to be the first wearing. In the initial impression, though, it's 
it's a close race. It's really hard to tell because I absolutely love Miami Tropical Seduction, but San Diego Pacific Sunset is a real contender for best of the house. Get a sample of this one, guys. It's very unique. I've never smelled anything like it. The, the airiness, the freshness to go with the zestiness of this blood orange, the way it's composed, it's done very well. It's done very well. Yeah, I'm digging this for sure. So my scent of the day, moving forward. City Rhythm, San Diego Pacific Sunset. Well, that's my first impressions on the new San Diego Pacific Sunset from City Rhythm Fragrances. Thank you again, Niles, for sending this my way. It is definitely going to get some good use. Um, I actually have Miami Tropical Seduction on my rotation table to wear in the next couple of days. So it's funny that I have this now and I immediately want to wear this more. So maybe it is already my favorite. Mm. Until next time, do me a real quick favor. Go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, because I do appreciate all the feedback and I love hearing from you guys. How many of you have tried this already? I know I'm not first to the party, but I'm definitely digging it so far. Uh, if you've tried this already, what do you think about it? If not, do you plan on trying it? Now, I'll have City Rhythm's website linked below. If you guys want to check it out, you can get samples, travel atomizers, on up to a 50 ml full presentation like you see here. And until next time, I will say if you get your hands on San Diego Pacific Sunset and you give it a spray now, I'm pretty damn confident you'll thank me later because it's smelling pretty good. Yeah, have a good one, guys.